I was having a conversation with one of my boys today, man. One of my homies, man. Shout out to him, man. Shout out to him, man. Uh, and he was just, you know what I'm saying? He was giving me a little insight about how somebody close to him was holding him to who he was in his 20s now that he's in his 30s. He doesn't even recognize or identify with that person. But the experience that this person that's close to him is having with him is still from that past from the past of who he used to be. Now, that was very, it was a very interesting conversation. But I just want to say that I've been through that myself. I've lived through it. And I'm still going through it right now, here today. It's people that's been close to me for a long time, most of my life. And they are trying to hold me to the past. But I want to say, you know what I'm saying? I'm not perfect. I made mistakes. And we all have. Those of us that grew up in the church, we understand. We can never be like Jesus, Yahshua. We can never be. So he was, there's no perfect person in this world. So if that's the case, we can't allow people to hold us to our past. As we grow, if they decide not to grow with us, depending on who it is, we got to let them go. Simple as that. Let them be who they are and don't allow people to hold you to your past and tell you because you are growing that you changing that you are arrogant. That's just confidence, baby. 